Greetings to you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Truth plus love equals life. Today, I'm going to show you something that's just absolutely shocking, and I don't know what to do other than just tell you the truth. Okay, now this is a picture of Santa Marin. Now, all anyone gets in this world is basically you must hate women. It's just absolutely ridiculous. You're going to hold people accountable as individuals, and that's it. This woman is like head of the, one of the head witches of the New World Order. I actually do pray for her. She is a pretty girl. Yes, I know it's that too. And why do you think the devil uses them? These people murder little children. They all act so nice. She was the youngest female president ever or whatever it is. Folks, you can look at a prime minister, I guess, what they call her. I'm sorry, I don't know. Um, right here. Pum, oh, yeah, prime minister. Prime Minister Santa Maria. By the way, in case anybody's wondering, I love learning about cultures, including Finland. Very special culture. There's nothing to do This is out of respect for the people of Finland and the little Finnish baby she murders. Okay. This came up on my YouTube feed, and I wouldn't normally have just looked at it. I had clicked on the date, and it was from, a, like, whatever it was a week ago, and I normally wouldn't care. But the picture jumped out at me. And, I mean, yes, like any other guy, I think, like, she's a pretty girl. I've seen her before, though. I mean, it's not like I had to have a picture, although I do think, you know, like, she's got nice skin. What a lovely, you know, looking girl. Santa Marin, Prime Minister of Finland. Okay, this is why it just jumped out at me. There is a prime minister of a country giving some kind of official speech to her, whatever Congress it is they call it, you know, I don't know. She's wearing, you know, a rose-colored shirt, which is fine, and it's a lovely color. It's a little unusual, though. Now, this is not Phoenician purple. I would describe this more of just like a rose or even a wine. Well, what's, what's, what am I getting at here? I looked it up. The death god of polytheistic paganism of Finland is called J.T. something or other, and it's a swan. No, I'm in fact uh, not joking. Yes, really. It's called the Swan of Tuonela. Forgive me, I don't know the exact name of it. Tuonelan Joutsen. The Swan of Tuonela. Not joking. I'm not joking. I'll put a link in here in the description. I don't know what else to say anymore. Here's why <laughs> it's so trippy. Okay. Once you start seeing these giant demon masks everywhere, you can't not see them. This is part of the revelation of God. Look at the picture of the swan on her chest, on her blouse. Right down, you know, right down the front of her chest. Pretend those wings are like sunglasses. Can you see it now? Those are the eyes of a demon. The tail feathers are the nose. And then the top would be like the corpus callosum in the third eye, like the top of the skull, the crown. The crown of Iris, the whore of Babylon. Can you see it? It's right in front of your face, and it jumped out at me, and I'm like, oh, my God. I'm like, I can't make this up. I'm, there's no way that I could make this up. It's not possible. I wasn't looking for it, although, I mean, you know, I mean, I, uh, there's all kinds of pretty girls on there. I was like, yeah, that's Santa Marin, that's that thing. Wait, whoa! I mean, I already knew about these people. It can't, I mean, I literally was like, what? I mean, imagine if, like, Trump was wearing, like, an orange shirt, like, all orange, and had a symbol on it. I don't care what it is. I'm noticing that. Or some prime minister just had like all pale mint green and a big giant pattern of a something. <laughs> okay. So they also have this thing called Cygnus, by the way, which I believe is the Swan um, uh, constellation. You can look it up. I saw that a long time ago. I think it was Ancient Aliens, which I'm not with, by the way. I prefer to call it like ancient archaeology or whatnot, you know. So look at this demon mask on this shirt. Look at it. Just look at the eyes on the wings. The top goes through this, not looking good guy. Now, here's the real sticker. Look underneath the legs, between the legs of this, of this photo right here. First of all, can you see the M? They look like M&Ms, right? That's why they call him M&M. Do you know why they call him M&M? Because if you were to take, uh, you know, symmetrical M's, one in the front and one in the back, 
Look up the diamond of like Le Burke, Roman diamond. It's exactly what it is. It's an M and M. And the top of the pyramid is over the M. And a diamond, imagine a pyramid top and a bottom stuck together. There's your diamond. That's the bad diamond pyramid. It's the top of a pyramid. So look between the legs of the swamp. Can you see the devil with his horns? Because that sure looks exactly like a two-horned devil figure. I'm not making this up. I didn't even, I don't even know how to video editors and I'll eventually learn. That's okay. But this is not what God has me doing here. I'm just a witness showing you how this works. And I'm not really here to please your flesh. You're going to have to find me and not want what the world wants. I mean, I can't make this up. That's why that's a like sacred symbol to them because it's a friggin' giant demon mask. Now, there's nothing wrong with the swan. There's beautiful swans. Is this not incredible? You think that's a coincidence on 3-14-2021? 2021 dropped to zero. Two at the top, two in the middle, one at the bottom. This is the year of their pentagram. What's 314? Well, that's pi, 3.1428, etc. It's also a triple, one over four, the cardinal points of the pyramid. On the triple pyramid, pentagram day. It's just a coincidence that the youngest having to find, you always got, I mean, Anytime someone defines themselves other than stick figure by merit, it's called a false demographic insertion and you're hiding behind something. So on a triple pyramid, pentagram date, I'm supposed to believe this woman just happens to, happens to wear a rose-colored swan song, looks like a demon mask with a devil in between its feet. And that's the name of Finnish paganism, death god. Do you think that's a coincidence? Do you think I could make that up? Do you think, I mean, you really have to bring the word conspiracy theorist. I mean, really? Look at, just look at it through innocent eyes like you're a three-year-old because that's all we're supposed to do. You know, it's also interesting. If you look underneath his wings, under, like in his armpits, follow the line up. It like leads to like a mountain pyramid kind of thing. Just follow it up to the top, like to his neck. Just follow the line right up to his neck. I don't know what else to say other than <laughs> praise Jesus, truth plus life. All these people are going to be exposed and I don't know how it all works. But that's just my job to share this with you. Uh, take it for what it's worth. I love you guys. I pray for Miss Santa Marin. I do. I don't. I want these people to, I want them to stop murdering little babies. These total witches, there's just no way behind the scene, folks. They've got like, she's got like four others. And it's a witch's covenant and they'll all hide behind the gender. But this is how it is. I mean, it might be Iceland, but I think, you know, I think it is. I think there's five of them in Finland. Although there's witches there. And there's warlocks, folks. There's, you know, men are just as evil. You just got to expose them all. I love you. Take care. In the name of Jesus. Truth plus love equals life.